Hi everyone, this is Lois Banks coming to you again from the Lois Banks Ministry. Today is May the 8th, 2020. And I just want to remind everybody um, about um, the relationship between Christ Jesus and Peter. We all know that, you know, Peter loved the Lord. I mean, Peter was ready to cut off folks' ears for God. I mean, he really did love the Lord. He did deny the Lord three times because he was scared for his life. But it didn't remove the love that he felt in his heart towards Jesus. And I want people to remember the conversation that Peter and Jesus, they were having. And, uh, you know, Peter was trying to stop Jesus from fulfilling the the will of God, the will of his father for his life. He he didn't mean any harm, but he didn't want anything bad to happen in Jesus. And when Peter spoke up, what did the Lord Jesus do? He rebuked him. He said, I rebuke you, Satan. You, you know, and he rebuked Satan. He wasn't rebuking Peter. He was rebuking the spirit that entered the conversation because Jesus knew automatically. He discerned quickly that what Peter was speaking wasn't coming from his father. It was coming from a dark side. And child of God, you must learn how to flow and operate in that too. You know, for instance, when Dr. Fauci first came out, you know, he he was talking a certain way. Um, you know, he was saying stuff like uh, he was giving information for people in the United States to protect their life. So, you know, as he was talking, the spirit of God would um, deal with me about what part of his conversation was accurate and true and what part you know, was coming from the dark side. So what you got to do is you got to learn how to pull stuff and use the part that's good and a part that's inappropriate. You don't use, for instance, I was telling people, because I could see going down the road that Dr. Fauci, the CDC, and the rest of the United States government, they had a plan, they concocted this plan to create immunizations i've been telling people for years do not take them darn immunizations um at when i was at my church for over 20 years um a doctor by the name of dr lorraine day who sat on um the immunization board she helped create the schedule she told my church years ago what was inside of immunizations i have been telling people for years stop taking immunizations Build your immune system with vitamin C, vitamin D, probiotics. You know, I was very specific as a nurse telling people the natural way to build the immune system because Satan was behind those immunizations and killing off millions. You hear me? Millions of people globally because people didn't know what was inside of the immunization. So when Dr. Fauci was up, during the pandemic, telling people certain things, the part that was protective, I would tell people, okay, now this part that he's saying is protecting your life. But then when they start talking about the immunizations, which I knew was going to come up, I reminded everybody, don't listen to that part of the conversation. That immunization crap they coming up with is a plan to kill people. So my spirit can discern when information is correct and on point and when Satan gets in there to throw people um, off track. Um, it's the same way, you know, that you should be walking in. You should be able to discern when something is accurate and when something is full of darkness. Okay, and um, I just wanted to bring that um, to everybody's um, attention. And the other thing I want to bring to your attention is God knows your body. He knows 
what's going on with this COVID-19 manipulation. God does not, I'm going to repeat this again. He does not want the COVID-19 to enter your body for any reason. Okay. So your, your immune system should already be built up. If you follow my ministry for any length period of time, you should be taking probiotics every day. You should be eating, you know, raw fruits and vegetables. that has the great, you know, good enzymes. You should be taking, you know, things that have natural probiotics in it, like kombucha or anything that has, you know, good, uh, probiotics like, uh, um, any foods, any foods. Okay. Anything that you like, anything that you like that has natural antibiotics, uh, probiotics in it. So, um, because it blesses the body probiotics, not antibiotics, probiotics. So, uh, with that being said, when God gave me three dreams, and said to wear a mask is because he didn't want that virus entering my body at all because he knows the damage of the manipulation. The virus has been manipulated. And to protect me in humanity, he said to wear a mask. God is higher in his thoughts than scientists. There are a lot of scientists out there that are you know, shedding the light about what's going on with Dr. Uh, Fauci, the CDC, the FDA, which I've been telling y'all for years. I've been telling y'all that the CDC, the FDA, all these governmental uh, entities are full of crap. I've been telling you that for a long time. So um, I'm just telling you now that God doesn't want that virus entering your body at all. Your body should be built up naturally from probiotics, which is completely linked to your immune system. So I'm just telling you right now, you're going to have to learn how to hear from God for yourself and rightfully divide communication, conversations, and what people are saying to you. Most of all, you should be going to God and hearing from God um, yourself. This is Lois Banks coming to you from the Lois Banks Ministry.